Crosses it left. Schweiger is there on the stop. Two, maybe three yards on the toss. A smart coach would call this one. It's second down and eight to go. <laughs> Only one man back. He hands it off. Gibson is there for the tackle. A smart coach would call this play. Ball on the 45-yard line. Gives the ball off. Number 21 comes up to make the play. Sure tackle by the cornerback, and they won't get to the first down marker. That first down marker just inside the 35. Green sends a man in motion. They give it to the halfback. Williams takes him down. Maybe a yard on the draw. Fifth play of this drive. Less than a yard to go. With the pass, he hits his receiver. Big pop that time. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. Gets rid of it. It's batted away. And there's not one wide receiver who can ever claim that he's never dropped a pass. It's just part of the game. Seventh play of this drive. Only one man in the backfield. Aimed it off to the back. Johnson comes up to make the play at the 26-yard line. Big tackle. He puts everything into that stick. They have to get it now to at least the 19-yard line. Goes with a short pass to the right side. The pass ball's incomplete. Green is getting up very slowly. It looks like he'll head toward the sideline and we'll get you an injury report as quickly as possible. And it's up. It had the distance, but it sailed right. Keep the defense guessing. Don't forget to use misdirection and play action to keep him off balance on passing down. The injury sustained earlier was minor, and they expect him to return to the game after a series or two. Lucy, Lucy. They'll shift some players around. Okay. Pass play here on first down. With the pass, and the catch is made. McLean pulls him down at the 46-yard line. Teams has for sides, and we'll start the second quarter. Two minutes left in the quarter. Jordan is lined up on the left. Rolls right. Gets rid of it. And this pass is completed. The 20. Woods makes the tackle. A player is getting up slowly. He'll head toward the sideline or an injury report as soon as possible. Get the pass and look to the sideline. You can't let the clock run down here. They're inside the 20. They'll go from the I formation. Raise the two. Switchy, come on. Damn it. Damn it. Grab it. Grab Rolling right, under pressure. Might be a face mask call, but will it be five or 15 yards? So it's a 15-yard penalty, not the incidental five-yard face mask. He's lucky his head's still on the way he got yanked down there. That infraction moves the offense into field goal range. Jordan lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Going to the air on first down. Down he goes. The protection broke down there. They got to find a way to give him a little more time back there. The defense was in man coverage, 
So he had some options out there in the secondary. He just didn't have the time to decide where he wanted to go with it. So an update now on the injury. It doesn't appear to be anything serious, and his return is probable. Dropping back, gets the pass off, and it's caught. McLean is there on the stop at the seven-yard line. The receiver showing us soft hands on that reception. The guy's been working really hard trying to improve. Looks like all that extra work is paying dividends. Kansas City lines up in a 4-3. With the throw, he finds his man. Watch this play. He's able to find a hole in the defense, and he gets into the end zone. Now, that's an example of how to use your personnel in the red zone and how to create mismatches. Need a shot to the top because the plot's to get rich. Tell you, exactly it is. I'm next for this. Success it is. Hit the best attack. This ain't whack. This hit us hop the red for this. This is the beast, baby. Out for nothing. Hut. And it's on its way. The point after is good. They have a one touchdown lead now. And that drive, John, is capped off with the touchdown. Big players make big plays, and that scores touchdowns. Give some credit to the linemen out there. They're the biggest guys in the field, and without them, no one gets into the end zone. Good distance. This one is handled by Hall. The Chiefs need to score quickly as they start this drive. First and ten. Tennyson is lined up on the right. He'll pass on first down. Pumps once. Throws it. Almost picked off. The little lob doesn't find its intended target. Green back in the shotgun. Pump fakes. Throwing. The pass ball is incomplete. He's throwing. He's throwing. Gonzalez lines up on the left side. Pressure coming, gets the pass off, and he hits his target. Kansas City will stop it there, less than two minutes to go in the half. Closing in. Kansas City pulls a timeout with under a minute left in the first half. Now they're looking at second and long after the sack. Kennison is lined up on the right. Drops back. Fakes the throw with the pass. This pass is incomplete. This is what I would call in this situation. Sixth play of this drive. Gonzalez is on the right of the formation. Quick throw. The defender's got it. Still running. Spins away. He threw that one up for grabs and it caught him. Be patient out there. When you see an opportunity, that's when you attack. But don't force it. Kansas City lines up in a 4-3. He'll pass on first down. On the run. He hits his receiver. He loses it. The Chiefs grab the live ball. So they'll turn it over in the red zone. The ball carrier always has to keep a firm grip on the ball. But when his team is deep inside the enemy territory, the worst thing you could do is fumble down here. The Raiders come out in a nickel package. Number 21 comes up to make the play. Already in their own territory, they'll lose even more with that territory. When you run those types of plays with this kind of field position, you better make sure you don't go backwards. The end of the second quarter with the score, Oakland 7, Kansas City 0.